Hey, and welcome to this Windows channel. And today we have learned a little bit more information about the numbering and how you'll know that you'll be on fall update and how it's going to work in Windows 10. Uh, so, first of all, Windows 10 fall update will actually bring a new f way of actually numbering Windows version. And, you know, we were thinking about that, the fall update, what it's going to bring. Um, we were thinking about also. Uh, not just the fall update, but you know, threshold two. W what's it going to change in the, the, the Windows version and so on? So, to get your Windows version, first of all, all you need to do is hold down the Windows key and tap R on your keyboard. There, you'll be able to type Winver. W I N V E R. Now, it will, for most of you, show this version. Microsoft Windows version 10.0 built 10 to 40. That's what everybody has, and um, that's what you should see right now. But starting with the fall update, which is threshold two in November, the version numbers are going to change to give you an idea of what version you're running. And so if I type this Winver in my insider preview, look at what it says here. Let's compare the two windows just next to each other. It says in my case, Microsoft Windows version 1511, build 10565-41737. So what I think is going to happen is this, that we'll have this version change, because that's pretty much what we uh, seem to be, uh, Microsoft seem to be telling us. And that number here, 1511, will uh, tell you the month and year of the update. So 1511 means November for 11, 2015. That's going to be as simple as that, and apparently that's the numbering uh, that's going to go on. So if Redstone's in 2016, we should have version uh, 06, uh, 1606, meaning June 2016. So um, that's an interesting thing. Um, and I think it's because they want to try to keep Windows 10 to version 10 and try not to put, you know, 10.1.2.3. Although, we're still wondering if we're not going to go to 10.1 when we get to Redstone, which will be a very big update in June. So, um, that's all you'll know. And when you get the fall update in November, well, everybody's going to be pushed to version 15.11 from the version they have right now, which is 10.0. So once again, to know your own version number, you hold the Windows key on your keyboard, tap the letter R, and just type W-I-N-V-E-R, enter, and it brings you that Windows version uh, immediately. Also, we, are, um, we have been told that it's official that every time there's a major update, like here, fall update, and uh, Redstone, and every other time there's going to be updates, we will have a, a new image file that you download from Microsoft. It means that if you like doing clean installs, you have a thumb drive maybe with a clean install of Windows or a DVD, every time a new version will come up, you'll have that new install disk available. So you'll be able to create your own install that will be to the latest version um, with the updates on it. So it means that after the fall update in November, you will be able to go and download, use the download tool to download the latest version of Windows 10, which, when you install it, will immediately send you to version 15.11, and so on. So this is cool because for tech guys, this is amazing. It's fast and it's easy. You know, talk to any tech guy, the updates drive you crazy when you want to uh, reinstall Windows. Uh, here, it's going to be simple. And what's cool also is that with that new way of actually activating Windows, you just, you know, get yourself a couple of uh, thumb drives or uh, DVDs with all the versions needed, and you just reinstall on any machine using that easy-to-do uh, feature of Windows 10. So that's uh, what's going to happen in the versions and the uh, latest news we have. And we're still waiting for uh, a date for uh, the uh, fall update which I do not believe will be like everybody thinks on November 2nd. I think it's going to be much later than that. 
don't forget that November ends on November 30th, so it could be even late November. If you enjoy my videos, want to subscribe to my channel, you'll be informed when your videos are online. If you have any comments, questions, problems, suggestions, why not ask us? We'll try to help you if we can. And um, maybe you can give us thumbs up if you like the videos. Helps us on the ratings on YouTube. Thank you so much for following us. You're a great crowd. It's always fun to make these videos.